In today's video, we're going to be talking about Bitcoin mining, mining for cryptocurrencies. If you don't know what mining is, this is going to be your number one resource to get educated on everything crypto mining. My name's Artie with CoinCaso. This channel is all about cryptocurrency knowledge. We want to teach you absolutely everything from the basics of Bitcoin, what is Ethereum, how does the blockchain work, and in this video, we talk about Bitcoin mining. So if these topics interest you, please consider subscribing to the channel. Bitcoin mining is extremely popular because it is a way for you to earn money without working, theoretically. Let's start at the very beginning. Bitcoin was created in January 2009. On that day, a program was released for people to download. When you sign up on the Bitcoin network, you're given a public key and a private key and a cryptocurrency wallet for Bitcoin. The program works on a peer-to-peer -peer network, allowing anybody on that network to buy, sell, and or give cryptocurrencies. Each transaction made on this network has an ID number called hash. And all of these transactions are recorded on a ledger known as the blockchain. These transactions are grouped together, sent out to the people on the network to be verified. These people on the network are called nodes or miners. All of these transactions, however, need to be verified by these miners before they can get added to the ledger, which is the blockchain. The process of verifying these transactions that's where mining comes into play. In order to verify these transactions, the system groups all transactions made within a 10 minute time frame all together. This 10 minute group of transactions gets sent out as an equation or an algorithm to be solved. Now, it's not a simple equation like two plus two equals four. It's actually solved using a hash function called SHA256. I'm not going to get into how this works because that is some in-depth stuff. Like, just look at the hash core logic of this hash function. It's seriously high-level encryption. When the Bitcoin network launched, these equations were much easier to solve because there was less transactions on the network. Back then, you could even use a normal desktop computer or your laptop to solve these hash functions. Over time, it became more and more difficult so these miners started using GPUs, your graphics processor in your computer, to actually aid in solving these equations because they have more computing power than your CPU. Now, however, you need specialized equipment to solve these equations. These are known as mining rigs. They are literally built for the one purpose of cryptocurrency mining. Most miners take these units and tie them all together in huge warehouses with massive amounts of cooling because of the heat that they produce. And these machines work together in congruence to help solve this equation. Now, why are they doing this? Why are they spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on these computer systems? The answer is simple. It's money. If your group of computers solves this equation for the 10 minute block, you are rewarded. The system generates 12 and a half Bitcoins and deposits them into your cryptocurrency wallet. In today's price, that's almost $100,000. This is where the analogy for mining comes into play because these computers are helping to solve this equation in the act of mining for gold. The reason these blocks work in 10 minute increments is because that's approximately how long it takes for these computers, these massive powerhouses of computers to solve this equation. Your computer or your mining rig is trying to guess two to the 256th computational algorithm. The probability of solving this equation is one and 115 Quattro Vigantillion. That is not a made up number. It is 115 with 75 zeros at the end of it. <sighs> Just to put this in perspective, winning the lottery jackpot is one in 14 million. That's only six zeros. So statistically, you're actually better off playing the lottery. But if you are the type of person that has hundreds of thousands of dollars sitting around collecting dust, I encourage you to buy a huge warehouse, set up this mining rig, make sure it's all working perfectly, get on the Bitcoin network, and start mining for Bitcoin. Could you imagine being the computer system that solves this equation almost every 10 minutes? 
you'd make $100,000 every 10 minutes. That's over a half a million dollars an hour. But just keep in mind, your electric bill is gonna be really, really, really high. And that's it, guys. That is the basics of Bitcoin mining. You used to be able to do it on your home PC, and now you need hundreds of thousands of dollars to invest in mining rigs. But the reward is well worth it. On the other hand, if you would like to learn how to get Bitcoins without having to deal with the process of mining for Bitcoins, you can actually start your own business and accept Bitcoins as a form of payment. That way, when people make transactions, you're getting Bitcoins. Instead of running these powerhouse computers, you can simply have a transaction where you earn Bitcoins from other people that already have Bitcoins. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you got some value out of it. I hope you learned something. Please don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel, like the Facebook page, and we will see you in the next one.